Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Located north of Natchez on the Pine Ridge Road, now MLK, Homewood rivaled the other great Natchez mansions in terms of scale and splendor. It was built by architect James Hardy for wealthy plantation owner William Balfour and his wife Catherine Hunt. The massive five-story Greek Revival mansion boasted a cruciform floor plan, delicate cast iron galleries, soaring 30-foot ionic columns, and a hex hexagonal observatory. The interior was appointed with marble mantel, silver door knobs, and fashionable Rococo Revival furniture. It also boasted uh, red glass that was imported from Belgium. Resting in a park-like grounds and surrounded by an array of accompanying outbuildings, the majestic mansion was a centerpiece of a 600-acre suburban estate. The Balfour family sold the property in 1907 to the Kaiser family, William J. Kaiser and his wife, uh, Clara I. Kaiser. In 1937, the property was sold by the Kaisers to Mr. and Ms. Kingsley Swan of New York. On January 2, 1940, Homewood burned to the ground. Local firemen later complained that the swans attempted to prevent the firemen from extinguishing the flames and quickly suspicion arose that the fire may have been an act of arson. There followed a sensational trial over exorbitant insurance claims filed by the swans and that only added to the mystery surrounding the loss of this great Natchez mansion. My name is Marion Smith. I'm a grandson of William J. and Clara I. Kaiser, who owned Homewood from 1907 until 1937. This has been a Natchez History Minute.